Welcome to LTG Mini, a bite-sized series about bite-sized news about Godzilla news. First up, Godzilla Minus One, and most notably, the Oscar award-winning Godzilla Minus One. Yes, on March 10th, 2024, Godzilla Minus One won an Academy Award for visual effects at the 96th Annual Academy Awards. This is the first Godzilla movie to win an Academy Award. It is a groundbreaking and huge piece of news that is going to change a lot of people's opinions on the series going forward. One of the big reasons the film won was because of its lower budget, budget somewhere around 10 to 15 million US dollars, while also producing outstanding visual effects. The visual effects staff for the movie numbered around 35, with 610 visual effects shots in the film. It does seem like it took a while to finish, as principal photography for Godzilla Minus One wrapped in either July or August of 2022. With a crew call for visual effects staff in November 2022, going into February 2023. It is unknown if that is a temporary position or if that was the entire post-production cycle timeline for Godzilla Minus One. Regardless, I would like to give a huge congratulations to Takashi Yamazaki and the entire creative team behind Godzilla Minus One. They created an amazing film that deserves all the praise it's been getting in both Japan and the United States. In other news, Godzilla Minus One again now has a Japanese Blu-ray release date, scheduled for May 1st, 2024. No word yet on an American release date, but it has been rumored that Janus Films will be picking up the release. They are the company responsible for the Criterion Collection, and since Godzilla has been in the Criterion Collection for some years now, it is entirely possible, and also adding on to the fact of its Oscar win definitely helps. And finally, Godzilla Kong the New Empire. The next entry in the MonsterVerse series of movies is scheduled for release at the end of March 2024. Figures are starting to come out for the movie, and yeah not much there to report it's just it's coming out tons of marketing for it right now that's all i really have for this week so i hope you enjoyed and i will see you all very soon for the launch of let's talk godzilla season two with the definitive american godzilla toys premiering later this month take care